Hey guys, we're here at Rancho Capistrano Winery with Kyle Branson, the owner here. We're going to be talking to him a little bit about how the winery got started. Welcome. Hi, thank you. So Kyle, tell us a little bit more about the story behind Rancho Capistrano Winery. How did it get started? Well, actually, my wife and I were having dinner around the corner, and we've been looking at the wine industry as my next career. Oh, great. I came out of financial services, and that all blew up back in uh, 2008 or so. And uh, we had put together a business plan, and it all seemed to make sense. We had a lot of connections in the, uh, in the vineyard business and other wineries, and even to a couple of winemakers. So we kind of brought everybody together with this idea, and this amazing building just fell into our, our laps. And uh, as we were building the building out, the opportunity to put in this big 3,000 square foot patio came about. And it just, it just grew and grew and grew. And amazing opportunities were put in front of us you know, almost every week. Awesome. It's an absolutely gorgeous place. Uh, the outdoor patio area, do you have live music there? We do. Yeah. Uh, currently we're going Thursday through Sunday. Uh, in, in the winter we knock it down to Friday and Saturday nights. But uh, yeah, Friday, Saturday night, you definitely need reservations because mm -hmm. there's an hour wait and the wow. place, yeah. place goes off. Wow. Do you Local. have people reserving for events and stuff too, birthdays and weddings? We do shows? actually. We do about six or seven weddings a year. Okay. Um, but you know, we are an obvious choice for a 40th or 50th birthday. Uh, I think we've got three or four this weekend coming up. Wow. And uh, we just cordon off a part of the patio for a group of 40 or 50 and uh, they get their own little area. They still get to enjoy the music and the fireplace and everything else. Um, is there a, do you have a favorite wine on the menu? This would be it. This is the one that's got my name on it. We call it Kyle's Cabernet. <laughs> that looks it, uh, Kyle's Cabernet. Love Let me, can I take a look? Sure. It comes from the Atlas Peak region up in Napa. The, uh, it's everything you'd expect in a Napa cab. It's uh, great tannins, very smooth, lots of berries. And uh, uh, it's been a, a customer favorite as well. Are all of your grapes from sourced from Napa or? No, we actually bring in grapes and juice from around the world. Okay. Uh, we have stuff on the shelf right now from France and Italy and Australia. But in the past, we've brought some things in from uh, Portugal and so on. And we bring in the, the crust and juice put them in the tanks, or we have bigger tanks in another location where mostly the fermentation takes place. Okay. And so we make it locally, but from often grapes from out of the country. That being said, we do have a couple of partnerships up in uh, Paso Robles and Mendocino that are providing us some really good juice uh, locally. Wow. And that, that does make up a bulk of our offerings, but we do bring stuff in from all over. Great, great. So you're supporting our local community as well, and you're bringing in we are. local grapes. So it's, That's great. Um, that's, that's what we wanted to be. You know, the, yeah. the name Rancho Capistrano Winery you know, it refers to the local town and what this was about. The whole logo was a collaboration of trying to bring together ranching and grapes. Absolutely. And, uh, this is, obviously, San Juan's got a big ranching and, and horse background. Yeah. And cattle. Absolutely. And that's what we're about. You think this will stay the, the only location, or do you plan to expand? We actually have a, a location in San Clemente in the works. Um, oh, okay. We're hoping to get it open by the end of summer, but that's maybe a little aggressive right now. Um, but we do, we're open three or four. And uh, again, the wine making capacity, and most of our wine making currently is in San Clemente at another location. And we can build that up. It's very scalable. Yeah. Okay. But you, can, but you can only buy our wines in our stores. We don't distribute. Okay, so um, you just, okay. We will be putting some stuff online shortly. Okay. But right now, if you want Rancho Capstone wine, it's, you got to come to Rancho Capstone wine. Do you have a membership? We do. In fact, we've got about 650, 700 members right now. Wow. Um, and the best part of that is we have a monthly party for our members, so they can come pick up their wine. We have entertainment on the patio. We open up a, uh, a buffet table and, and give them some snacks while they pick up their wine. And it goes on for a couple of hours. And it becomes very popular. In fact, it's a Monday night. And the line goes around the building. Wait, really? Wait, wait. So it's, uh, wow. it's a big deal. Wow. You might have found your, found your newest members. <laughs> we'll sign you up. Definitely. And now, what does a membership run? Memberships currently are between $50 and $60 a month. Okay. And for that, you get two bottles, plus a free tasting for yourself and a guest whenever you come in, yeah. in addition to the party we have for you every month. Wow. Fifty or sixty dollars a month. That's very feasible for most people. You free know? glass of really wine, nice. and yeah. Tasting for you and your guests when you come in. This, yep. That's great. That's really good. Really neat. 
Well, it certainly has wonderful energy, and um, I love the outside patio area. It just seems like a really great place. Um, well, thank you. Yeah. And their food. You have yeah. amazing food, too. We did. Actually, we just won Best Restaurant in San Juan Capistrano. Uh, in fact, we won 10 Best of San Juan Awards last year, which I hear was a record. Uh, everything from you know, hamburger to wine to ambiance to outdoor dining and so on and so forth. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. Food is, I, I was here for the chili cook actually. Oh, yes. That was so much fun. <laughs> yep, yep. That's going to become an annual event for us. That's great. Well, definitely come down and check it out, guys. It is beautiful down here if you haven't been um, to the Rancho Capistrano Winery. So come on by, and Kyle will help you out. So we'll be here. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hi, this is Bree and Marissa. Thank, Thank you, you for subscribing, subscribing to, to the Grassroots Gals. Gals. We look forward to bringing you the best family-owned businesses. Follow along and keep buying local.